In this short video, I want to show you how to set up your environment so that CPP unit and the testing template work properly. So uh, in order to do this, you need to click on CPP unit, go to properties, and set the includes directory. Now there will be something in there already, uh, and you need to change that. So click on the add button, and go to workspace, and then for the CPP, for both of them actually, you'll need to set it to CPP unit and include. Click on OK. And then um, uh, click on OK here. You'll need to do the same thing with the testing template. So go to C++ compiler includes. Delete what's ever there. And then add workspace, CPP unit, and include. After that, you can build all projects, build all, and um, both should then be ready for uh, execution. So this will take uh, a couple of minutes uh, for um, that to completely run, um, for that to, to completely compile. Once it is actually done, then uh, you'll be able to add your code into uh, the testing template and test it um, as was shown in the previous podcast. So anyway, that should, uh, uh, that should correct any errors you might be seeing in the way that uh, Eclipse is handling the, uh, the libraries. Um, use that to uh, uh, use this technique to, uh, uh, to build your system. So anyway, I'm going to let this thing run here a second. Um, testing template should be ready. Execute that, and the testing template uh, you know, runs as expected.